Hi, my name is Reen Condon and I'm running for the faculty, com faculty convener of Engineering and Computing. I'm Abba Hayden and I'm running for Engineering and Computing faculty rep. Uh, Conor McCullough and I'm running for faculty rep of Engineering and Computing. I'm running because I have a passion for student representation. I love helping students and I want to bring more to DCSU. I'm running because I'd probably be the first female convener in the faculty. That's the main reason. Um, other reasons are to promote STEM, to uh, have better engagement with the SU, and also to promote the societies within the faculty. Uh, I'm running because like, uh, I've been a class rep for the last year and it's been a really interesting experience. I've got to meet lots of different people and lots of different backgrounds and lots of different hobbies and interests and it's just been really interesting to see that kind of thing and I kind of want to take it to, to the next level and kind of do more parts of the, do, be a bigger part of the SU I guess. Within the engineering faculty there, there has been a few issues from what I've experienced in my first year here uh, such as uh, having say five exams in a row which isn't uh, according to some people isn't uh, within the regulations so I'm hoping to fix that for next year uh, also that, that the, al the allocation for labs is very in inefficient and it's not really prioritized uh, people who say have assignments worth 20% and they need a, a lab space to actually do it and they can't go down to the library because all the, in all the uh, software isn't on there so I'm hoping to just uh, optimize the lab allocation make it more efficient and then somehow prioritize some lab spaces um, to be honest, in the engineering faculty, we're the forgotten faculty, I think, with the SU. So what I'd like to see is the SU engage with us more, um, kind of cater the events more to a time that suits the engineers, and also to see the engineers engage more with the SU as well. One of the things I've noticed a lot is that, um, in general, for, for a lot of students, they, don't, they can't actually attend a lot of the events we have. Um, a lot of them live either off campus, with, at home, or just simply don't necessarily enjoy some of the events we have like a lot of them are centered around alcohol and a lot of people don't i was a bit surprised at the sheer volume of people that don't actually like that and it's just it's interesting just to see that and i kind of feel there needs to be more tailored for them for that group of people and just more things to engage more students is, is a big point for me so I hope to work with the head of school, head, head of school, so uh, people like Rory O'Connor, uh, to actually do these, uh, put these th p uh, things in place, and then work with module coordinators, uh, who actually help set up, set out the timetable, and then if they have say labs where it's not full, but they don't want any people in there, we need to stop that, so that say fourth years and third years who are actually contributing towards their degree have somewhere to do their do their work, and they aren't pushed out into a a packed lab such as LG25? Um, first of all, obviously, kind of whoever is running the SU next year to ha be able to sit down with them, talk through, make sure our voice is heard that, look, we're in class 9 to 6 every day. There's a lot of events that aren't really catered for us. Um, I'd also like to see Engineers Week part of the SU calendar. So that'd be one of the main things I'd be looking at doing. And also just general promotion of STEM, which is science, technology, engineering and maths um, around campus, just so people are aware that we're not just stuck in the engineering building all the time. Um, well, I have a lot of different ideas of what I want to do. And one of the main things is um, I was thinking of or organizing um, a mock version of the Olympic Games. I was thinking of calling it maybe Fracasy Games or something like that. and. Uh, it would just have a load of different random events and it'd be there'd be some sporting and some kind of maybe related to the courses and then there would also be like complete and other pistic events just to just to spice it up a little so uh, hopefully if either way i hope to do something along the lines of that at some point the dream job i'd say just working in in my field any like in any top company in my field because I absolutely love computer science and it's just, it is my dream job to be honest. Okay, that's really good. <laughs> I'd actually love to be an engineer er, uh, an engineer in the ISS, the space station, because you see the cool photographs that they take from space, so that'd be a pretty cool job to have for whatever six months or a year. 
Like, well, inventor is kind of the thing I'm aimed towards with engineering, but it's not necessarily an exact, you know, path to it. But um, that would be kind of the thing I'd be aimed at purely because I want to help make a change. I know that's as, as stereotypical as it gets, but like just something to help contribute to society, I guess, is, is in some way, shape or form I'd be happy with.